I got it. Woo! Here you guys have it. Hey, what's up guys? It's Will from Bass Bait. And uh, today I'm out at a local stream and uh, got my polarized glasses. Now, the two species we are going for are some trout and, and sucker fish. I may have may not have said this already. It is clear water. Last time I was here, caught two huge suckers. Um, and where I went last time, where I didn't catch any fish, I caught a uh, tiny rainbow early in the morning. But uh, enough talking. Let's get to fishing. Okay, well, first off, I'm starting with this uh, Cat King Circus with just a tiny uh, spoon. This is a bass spoon, I believe. Uh, got this off an Amazon kit when I just got into bass fishing. So, well, the first spot I looked at was normally packed with suckers and trout. Uh, didn't seem to be here today. So, but when I came down here, I saw a couple. So I came back. Now I bl oh, got a snag. Okay, so I got my snag out. Uh, like I was saying, I believe these suckers are invasive species. So I'm trying to catch a few. I'm, I'm doing catch and release, unless I catch a nice big uh, trout. My dad might want it, so. All I'm doing is casting it upstream and uh, reeling it on back. But uh, I'll let you know if I see any extra fish and uh, or if I actually have a couple bites and get one. Well, yeah, I saw a couple swim over there. Dang. Well, uh, I'm making a move to the other side where they have actually spot salmon and uh, suckers. I, like he was saying, I don't know if I caught that on camera. I believe we're allowed to snag them. So I'm going to try and get them. But uh, last time I came here, like I said, I caught some, but two or three pretty big ones. So, I'll try and do it again for you guys. Well, uh, I walked down the stream a little, little ways. Uh, didn't see anything. So I'm back to the spot where those guys saw a couple trout and some suckers. I'm trying to see them. I can't really, even with my polarized. So, um, I'm gonna try and go on the other side again see and then head downstream a little ways but it's pretty slow moving and calm so um, I will see you guys if I get one okay so I found some suckers there's a bunch over here so I'm gonna try they're like right in front of me I don't know if you guys can see them but uh Yeah, there's some over here.
Yeah, it's pretty hard for you guys to probably see, but uh, I can see them, but when I polarize, you can barely, so. Oh, I'm right above one. Dang it. Mine doesn't seem to sink enough. Right over here. Oh, I had one. You crossed my line. <laughs> really hope you don't scare them away. There's one. There's some. They're over here. Watch out, watch out. <laughs> Can't watch out. <laughs> Back up. <laughs> yeah, they're right over here. Just hold on. Um Go ahead. I'm use. I'm not seeing them with my glasses. Ooh. You can see them up there. Oh, now I can't see them. They look straight ahead of you. I am, I'm a loop. Oh, I almost had one. Oh, that's why my lure's so screwed up. Here, Dad, come right here. You might be able to see them. Oh, now you can't see them because the wind's so bad. They're right over here. Here, that switch spots. Oh, I really need to get one of these. Oh, huh, it's snowing. It's snowing in spring, everybody. Oi! Okay. Okay, got my glasses back. Okay, don't fall in. I won't. Dad, how do you not see him? How do you not see him? Oh, beauteous, right when I'm about to cast. The wind has to get terrible. I casted right next to one. I need a heavier sinking lure, but I don't have any on me. Oh, oh. I think I'm gonna run back to the truck, tie on a heavier lure, and then come back. I just realized I have a heavier lure. It's a Rap Rapala floating jointed on some 12 pound floral so it's going to sink better and they're kind of like laying on top of each other so if you miss one there should be a couple underneath so it shouldn't be that hard to get them yeah you guys probably couldn't see them anyways But it, they are right there. Oh, 
almost call it a tree. There they are. They are taunting me. I have to go get a heavier lure. This is not doing it. And maybe with a bigger hook. So I will see you guys when I... Okay, so I switched my baits. I switched to this pretty heavy uh, blue swill silver spoon. And uh, I'm gonna try and catch them here. So I'm gonna get back up onto here and I'm gonna uh, cast and catch one. You guys can see that, but it's legit right in front of me. This is gonna be it. Dang it. This one's so chill. It went right over it. This may be the one. This may be the one before I leave, you guys. It's making such big of a splash, too. It's, it's not even moving. I got it! Woo! It's... You got it? You got it? It's a nice little guy right there. Finally. I Oh, it's probably just laid its eggs. God, do not break my rod. Well, here you guys have it. Jesus. My rod just hit me in the leg. Well, you guys have it. Uh, finally caught a sucker here. Um, this was pretty big. What if I uh, get away on this guy, don't you say? Yeah. I'm gonna set you guys down real quick. I'm gonna get a nice little way. Oh, my hand is so slimy. Okay, so as you guys can see, it's one kilogram. Uh, this scale only goes in five pounds, but uh, it's pretty nice. I'm gonna let this guy go and then I'm gonna end the video. Well, there you guys have it. Um, thank you guys so much for tuning in. Uh, I'm going to try and come back here again some other days. Uh, like I said, thank you guys for tuning in. This is Bass Bait from Will, signing out. Peace.